If you cut off some leaves and keep it in a plate after some time, the leaves start to dry up. Why does this happen? To understand that, let us do a little activity. For this, we will need two transparent glasses, a cardboard, some petroleum jelly, a twig with leaves or a small plant, and plasticine. Make a hole in the center of the cardboard. Put the root of the plant through the hole. Use plasticine to seal the sides of the plant. Put some petroleum jelly on the sides of the glass to seal it. Fill three-fourths of one glass with water. Cover it with cardboard and press to seal it. Cover the plant with the second glass and keep it under light or outside under the sun for some time. After some time, observe the setup. You will be able to see droplets of water formed on the glass at the top. Where did they come from? From the experimental setup, it is quite clear that the water could not have come from the glass below as it is sealed off. So the source of the water has to be from the leaves. Leaves are known to give out water in the form of water vapor through a process called transpiration. This evaporation through the leaves is how plants lose water. Transpiration is important as it produces a cooling effect and saves the plant from the hot sun. And so it is in many ways like perspiration or sweating that keeps the human body cool. Also, it creates a pull force or the suction force on the water molecules left behind in the leaves, which helps the water to rise up from the root to the top of the plant.